Well, joined by our iconic player of the match, Tom Wesley. Tom, did you enjoy that by any chance? Yeah, no, it's good fun. It's good fun to bat with, obviously, Sir Alistair. Um, but it's just nice contributing to, to an Essex win. But I think the way that we set that game up with the ball was, was fantastic. So very, very happy and sweaty at the moment. <laughs> I joked with you before the match about being the third spinning all-rounder, yeah. and so it proved. One for 13. 18 odd not out and hitting the winning runs and taking that important catch off Simon Harmer as well. So it all happened for you yeah. today. You must have just felt that the wind was in your sails. Yeah, I suppose it's one of the better games that I've had. Um, it's nice to contribute to the ball. I obviously used to bowl a little bit in the past. Um, we reckon three leg breaks in two. your three overs? Two. Two, okay. yeah. yeah. Didn't come out as well as I'd like. I still need to work on those, I think. I need to get up to sort of Sam Robson standard. Um, but no, it's just nice to step up, bowl a few overs. Obviously, that fifth seamer role is something that myself, Paul Waters and Tendo are doing between ourselves at the moment. So if one of us is going nicely, it's nice that we can get a few more overs out of it. But obviously, unfortunately, it looked like uh, Jimmy Porter's done something to his side. Not entirely sure what, but um, yeah, we'll just have to see how that goes. It was a very impressive performance all round with bat and ball. So important psychologically to get back-to-back -back wins after the victory in Southampton. Yeah, I think, you know, I touched on that down in Southampton. I think with white ball cricket, T20, 50 over cricket, if you can win a game, win a couple of games, momentum does count for a lot in the shorter format. So it's obviously nice to, to back a fantastic performance up in Southampton with, you know, one of our more comprehensive wins, I think, that we've had for, for a while. So, no, very pleased and, and chuffed with the boys. There's been tornadoes, thunderstorms, <laughs> lightning across Essex. We didn't get didn't it. Get anything. No. But how good was it to a finish the match and b have a, a good crowd in here to, to yeah. roar it on? I think that's one thing you know we've we've missed massively at Essex, and I think by the high standards that we've set over the last few years um, and all the success that we've had, you know, it is. It's been challenging not having our supporters because they are, they're vocal, they get behind the guys and um, it's a shame that we haven't been able to have them in the last 18 months. So it does make a big difference that they're back in. So, And I think we play better cricket when they're in, which is, which is always a good sign. So um, no, it's brilliant to, to have some supporters back in and hopefully we can keep getting more and more in well, as the summer goes on. Congratulations. Enjoy the four days rest before the Worcestershire Rapids yeah. arrive on Thursday. More of the same, please. Oh, no pressure.